Hi everyone, I'm Rachel from Rugby Art Gallery Museum and I'm here today to show you our craft kits that we've created for the Tudor Palace. These are available for you to purchase from Rugby Visitor Centre, which is located in the foyer of our building. Now there are several craft kits available and in this video I'll be showing you the contents of our clay creations kit. Now these are for you to use at home with the contents provided. Within this video I'll be giving you a suggested idea of a craft that you can use the contents with at home. Before we get started on the suggested craft, I'm just going to show you what's inside the kit and to let you know any other materials you might need to gather from around your home. Let's take a look inside the Clay Creations kit. Now the kit handily comes in this really useful zipper bag which you could use for other projects to store them. So inside you have paintbrush, a pack of air dry modelling clay, some clay tools and a set of instructions. Now optional extras, you might like to use some parchment paper to mould your clay onto so it doesn't stick to the surface that you're working on. And once it's finished you might like to use paint and PVA glue to decorate. Okay, so I have everything ready for the clay creations. Got my packet of clay which I need to open up. Just cut the top off with a pair of scissors. And take out the modelling clay. Make sure you've put your parchment paper down on the surface you're working on but also protect it as well with a tablecloth just as this will get quite messy. So first thing you want to do is split your clay into three pieces. Like so. And use your tool for that as well, it's really handy. Take the first piece and just start to mould it in between your hands. The heat from your hands will make it easy to do. And what we're going to do is we're going to roll this into a ball. Like so, just do roll it in between the palms of your hands like this, or if you prefer, roll it on the surface like this. And then with the palm of your hand, just press down to create a base. This is going to be the base for our bowl because what we're doing is we are making a Roman inspired clay coil pot. Okay, so once we've done that, just pop that to one side and I want you to do the same thing with the other pieces of clay. Except this time with this one, we're going to roll this into a coil. So do that by laying it on the surface of your parchment paper and roll it back and forth over the palm of your hand, like so, until it starts to sort of form that sausage shape. But keep going as you want to create a long coil. So just keep rolling until it's much thinner and then you also want to do the same with the other piece of clay as well. Okay, so once you have your coils, the next thing you want to do is take your modelling tool and create very light scores that go around the edge of the base for your pot, like so. And once you've done that, you also need to do that along the length of the coil as well just like so and then once you have done the base and both the coils you want to dip your finger in some water and just run that over where we've scored like so so run that over the coil as well help it stop it from drying out too quickly and also help it move so we're going to attach our coil to our base now by winding the coil
foil around. So you've wound it around all the way around the base there and now this is where you want to start moving the coil now over the top of that coil that you've already put down and just trying and just smoothing and sort of applying a little bit of pressure as you go around as well. Just keep winding the coil all the way up and we're just going to score the other coil now as well just very lightly to enable it to move a little bit easier and just take a finger very lightly add a little bit of water as well okay and then just continue from where you were before add a dab of water to connect the two ends of the coils smooth those out a little bit and then as we were doing before keep moving the coil on top of the other like so and you can start to see that our bowl is starting to look more like a bowl there we go keep winding around to the top there we go I don't know from there. There we have it. So what you could do is you could leave it like this or you could add some more water to your finger and start smoothing the inside and the outside edges so that everything starts to mould together. So that's what I'm going to do here. Just take a, a wet finger and start smoothing them together and you might want to push that end of that coil into the other and just start putting everything together okay so as you can see I've just spent some time smoothing out the clay and really joining all those pieces together by lightly pick that up you can see that's all smooth together all right so what you need to do now is just put that back on the parchment paper and leave that to air dry fully I would recommend leaving that to dry out overnight somewhere nice and warm so paint your pot using a mixture of PVA glue and some poster paint. Just mix them together and that will help the paint stick to the pot. Okay, have fun sculpting with clay. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget that there are other craft kits available and tutorial videos to go with.